Dear brothers from planet Earth, I am Quan Yin. I bring each one of you today a small rose, a lilac rose. So that it fills the hearts of each one of you with much love and peace. Feel at this moment, the vibration that I bring to all of you. The moment is not being easy for many. The moment is calm for some. It doesn't matter. What each person is experiencing is part of their journey, part of the journey that needs to be completed. Have faith and trust in what you are planting. It is important that the hearts are connected with the minds, in what you desire. It takes action, along with thought. It takes feeling along with action. There needs to be this balance, so that you act correctly, feel correctly, and think correctly, within the same aspect, within the same desire. It's no use just for the mind to want to evolve, if the heart still screams the ego's screams. If actions are contrary to the path of light, then, there must be the whole in each action. You need to find this balance in every thought and action. So that they can effectively put themselves on the road to the fifth dimension. Many people try, 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 and slip a lot. They slip into repeating mistakes, repeating actions, repeating thoughts that should no longer exist. And, unfortunately, each of them generates a negative percentage on your journey. And you will have to do much more positively to get out of the place. There is no point, my brothers, in deceiving yourselves, in trying to think that nothing has consequences. Everything has consequences. Every act, every thought, every feeling has consequences. So constant vigilance is necessary. And I would say that thoughts are the most insidious, because they are fast. And they come sometimes without you even thinking about them. So when this happens, when a wrong thought comes, think exactly the opposite. Think intensely about what you really believe in and want to do. This will be able to cancel that wrong thought. And it will allow you to move forward a little. It's constant control. You cannot be careless for a second, because a second brings many thoughts. So be careful with them. Be careful with what you vibrate. Vibration produces thoughts. Because those around you are hungry for a low vibration. And they are always ready to pollute your minds with wrong thoughts. They are everywhere. So be careful with what you vibrate. If you vibrate high, they move away, because this is not their energy. And then they don't affect their minds. So be careful. With places, with people, with moments. Everything attracts them. All it takes is for the vibration to drop. So, you must always be attentive, alert, vibrating high, so that these thoughts, which are meaningless, but which do a lot of harm, pollute your minds. Those thoughts that come from yourselves are enough, which are often also very interesting. So, my brothers, the journey is not as easy as many think. Many think that just meditating, just asking, just following a path, just doing a bunch of procedures and everything is fine. Of course this all helps, of course this all keeps the vibration high. But the thoughts leave you. So, if you keep thinking negative thoughts, all this work is in vain. Because he is destroying everything you achieved in a certain procedure. So, there needs to be a lot of control, there needs to be attention, there needs to be a lot of vigilance. Every second. Vibrate high, all the time and you won't even need to worry about your own bad thoughts, because the vibration is high and they are automatically cancelled. Vibe loud, vibrate loud, vibrate loud. This is the mantra of the moment, I need to vibrate high. Or they will teach you a mantra, a little easier and much more powerful. I am light. Repeat this mantra three times each time. And you will see how you will attract more and more light and the thoughts, those that should not come, will begin to become more and more distant. It seems simple, but it is a very powerful mantra and I guarantee you, it will bring the balance that each of you needs. Look at my code of light that I left today. He has my dragon, he has two swords and he has the lotus flower. And he has a code emanating energy all the time. Look at the swords. Let the dragon fulfill his role, destroying everything that is necessary in your path. And I will always be together, 
just a thought away, just think of me.